Hey you guys, thank you so much for joining me. Today I have some really super cute items that I wanted to share. Some of these things I purchased before um, we left for our road trip and some of these things I actually accumulated as we were traveling and I brought them back home. Um, so I'm so, so excited. Happy New Year to everyone. I hope you guys are having an amazing start to the year. I know I am. Still a little exhausted, but I'm getting things together around here. Anyways, if you're not already subscribed, please join me. I would love to have you here. And make sure your bell notification is on because I've been getting so many um, emails and updates from you guys saying that you didn't even know I posted videos. So I definitely can see the impact um, that's having it on my channel as well. So please make sure your bell is on. Anywho. Thank you so much. Happy New Year once again, and let's get into this home decor haul, all right? Right, let's start with Z Gallery. How exciting. So I haven't been into a Z Gallery store in such a long time. Um, so I was really happy that we were able to stop when we were up in Dallas. I picked this um, table runner up. I've always wanted it, uh, but I wasn't quite sure which one to get, the gold one or the silver. So this is a beaded one. It was quite pricey, but at the time it was on a discount. Um, an additional like 25% off or something like that. Um, so I have it here on my table. It is so beautiful, long and luxurious. It's, it hangs over on both sides. So this is how it looks here on the table. And I have different objects like these little candlesticks. I'm trying to get the, um, the wrinkle out. So I'm like putting different objects on here to get it because it was rolled up stuck inside of here this long table runner but anyways this is starting out it's so beautiful look at that I love it so happy I went with this color instead of like the two-tone gold and actuality the other ones are on sale they're only like 30 something dollars and these are originally a hundred and twenty nine dollars so check Z gallery out right away because they do have different versions of this that's like 30 something dollars right now Okay, this was supposed to be our New Year um, table, <laughs> New Year, some of this items on here, right? So let me move these out the way and I'll share that in a moment. So I got these and I thought we were going to be here for the New Year or whatever. Um, so I purchased a few of these out of World Market. I thought they were so cute, so festive. So I picked up the gold ones and um, the pink and I even have like some blue wine bottles some really cute ones um, I just stuck them back on this table again. I'm just using what I have to flatten at my Table runner pick this tray up before we left from home goods. It is so cute Let me move it so you get all these items off of here So this is how the tray looks it has like the crush diamonds or beads or whatever inside of it and it's so beautiful so home goods I don't remember probably like 20 something dollars um yeah I found it these cuties right here came out of Z gallery whenever I purchased this in Dallas they were $7.95 but again they were all like 25% off so I ended up getting like six I got two gold and four silver because I like to mix and match so, I just have them all sitting here on my table. Um, just, you know, because it looks cute. So, it's just sitting here. Just like that. And put all this stuff back on here. Yep. And then, again, like they said, these came out of World Market. And so, got these. I already showed these, I think, in my last home decor haul. Found them at Home Goods. For $12.99, but I even actually found a larger one now, so I have a total of three. So here goes the larger one. This one was a little bit more. It was $16.99, and the smaller one is $12.99. So that's how it looks. So, and there's the other one. And I'll have three. That'll be really cute on a bookshelf somewhere as well. But that is cute. So that's my little... um tablescape huh, for the moment all right let me go grab the other z gallery items all righty so i picked up um six plate dinner plates and six like saucers from z gallery these are the um white and like a pearl 
in gold. I'm not loving this color as much as I thought I would. It took me so long to choose a color because Z Gallery has some beautiful dishes. Um, but I thought I will love the gold, but I don't know if I do or not. So if I ever get back down to a Z Gallery, I may go ahead and switch these dishes out like the colors and go with a different one. But nonetheless, this is how they look took some of these stickers off but these still have them on there yeah I don't know so this is how they look if I go ahead and set it I thought it would look good with my um, table legs okay so this bag was able to carry all of my dishware back and I'm so excited about it okay these I found in St. Louis, right? They came from Home Goods. They marked them down because I guess it was a set of four, but they only had a three. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them. Um, if I can't find any more, I may just go ahead and return them. But I thought they were so cute. Um, so yeah, I only have three of those, but I did find these. These are seem to be a bit smaller, but I have a four pack of these and again these were $12.99 yeah these are a bit smaller than the red ones yeah the red ones are a little larger okay so yeah these are so cute they are a Z gallery inspired this is a dish this is a plate like a dinner plate size it's not a charger so pretty so I do like those. Again, I only have four. So when I get back to the home goods here, um, now that I'm home, I'm going to go see if I can find either um, another pack. So I'll have a set of eight. And if I can't, again, they will go back as well because I can't do anything with just four. So if I can't find them again, I will return them. But yeah, they look like this on the back. But definitely way cheaper than Z Gallery. So home goods, and they're still. The rest of them are still like wrapped up in here. So that's what I did. Bought this um, towel from Ikea. And then I wrapped all of my Ikea dishes in here. And these are simple white plates. How cute. And they were less than a dollar a piece. They were only like 69 cents or something. 89 cents. I don't remember. They're plain. Now they are really, really thin. So like um, they would chip really easily if you try to use them for everyday wear. But I thought they would look so cute as a tablescape. I mean, you can do, I did buy a few extra to use to eat on, but they're really thin again. But they're nice and plain. They'll look really pretty as a tablescape. Look, just against this white, just against this beaded runner. Look how pretty that looks. And then if you put, what if I have like, since they are a bit smaller than the actual plate, look, you can just style it like that. How cute is that, right? All right, so, yes, I had to purchase a lot of dishes. I don't know why I went dish crazy, but I just saw all these sparkly ones, and I just felt like, oh, I need them. Then I went to Z Gallery, and I knew that I wanted some dishes from there, but I'm bummed that I didn't make a great decision that I love. But anyways, that's all of my dishware I believe oh no I did pick up a few more bowls and stuff from Z gallery that looks like I mean from Ikea but I've already washed and put them up okay here goes some of the items that was purchased that we just put over here in this little station Ikea this was I thought it was really cute inexpensive a few dollars just a like a napkin holder okay so I like that it's gold and these are the napkins that I had out um, that I was supposed to use for like for New Year's whatever but this is how they look so if you have like a little gathering or something how cute is that so Z Gallery a few bucks um, no not Z Gallery Ikea this also came from Ikea this gold tray I do have a silver one from there and I, I'm kind of thinking that I already have this gold one when I lived in Germany, I don't know, but I just went on and purchased it again. It looks really cute. Like, I can place it on my um, island. 
and style a few things like here come the spring and whatever so probably like 20 bucks from ikea home goods you know it's about to be valentine day next month so they are having so many cute horror items these are only 6.99 it's only four but i figure i could put one on like coffee table a few around my island and it'll be really cute so i like the colors like a blushy pink yep all right i found these as well at home goods um when i found this these came in a pack did, I, did these come in a pack? I believe, yeah, these came in a pack of two. I'm not mistaken. I don't know. We've been traveling too long to remember. But they are so darling. They are made by Nicole Miller. They, I guess, are placemats. But I was thinking I may even actually turn them into a pillow. Because the only thing I have to do is open a scene and stuff it with cotton. And it would turn into a pillow. But either way, look at how cute move this out the way look at how cute that is if i did leave it as a placemat to set it here or i can put it up here on my countertop just style them on the counter like that i don't know but they're really really nice like super cute and then the back is just a plain yeah so i like it a lot so it's a heart Okay, found this cutie right here. It didn't make it back. It has a little bit of a boo-boo on it, but I found another one. A little small, but this is what happened as I was traveling. So I'm going to just put a little glue and hopefully you won't necessarily see it. But this is how it looks. I don't have that size. thought it was really cute. Home Goods, um, Dallas yeah oh and i forgot to share i think this is the victoria line i got this also from z gallery i thought it was super cute let me just add it over here it's just like a little um bottle stopper i'll lay it down it's so cute i know i love little bottle stoppers little cute inexpensive ones but that's how it looks it matches all of my other decor okay let's talk about this lamp here i purchased it in st louis from ikea this lamp traveled so many miles with us <laughs> i was determined to have it i thought it was so cute um when i looked up the shipping when we were inside the ikea store um the lamp is only 99 dollars, but they will want it um 49 dollars for shipping so i was determined to get it home so we just placed this in the back across the, like the the headrest area like in that area we took the took it out the box the lampshade was tricky but it made it home and did not get damaged <sighs> i love it but i'm not 100 percent sure it's going to stay in this area i'm not loving it so far i'm, I'm going to leave it here for a few days and let it grow on me but i put it like here in this area and i thought the gold would be a, a great addition to match this um lamp i mean not lamp this mirror that i just added over here let me cut this and it is also a gold right but I don't know. It's just not wowing me. So I may find another home for it. Nonetheless, I still like the lamp. I just don't necessarily love it in this area. Again, Ikea, it traveled so long so far with us. Okay, here are some things that's still just sitting over here. Um, purchased these napkins. I thought they were really cute. They came out of Ikea for a few bucks. Actually, I believe these were probably like part of the holiday collection. I think it was on clearance, if I'm not mistaken. This was actually on clearance as well. I thought it would be cute for Valentine's Day. Place it somewhere. Again, it's a napkin holder, but I may put it outside on my back patio. Something like that. And then these are going to go into my pantry. So I got two of that little smaller size. And then I have one larger size. And then I thought these were cute. They were on clearance, I guess, again, from the holiday season. So I just picked them up. I love plants, so I don't know. I thought I would love the red, but I may end up actually spray painting them, like, 
white or something. And then putting little flowers in them for the spring. More little napkins. Um, really cute things that you can just place. You know, little cute napkins in there like that. Pick these up out of Michael's for like 70% off. So they can probably go on my coffee station next year. And again, for Valentine, these were actually part of their like Christmassy line, but they were like really cheap for only like a dollar. But I can use them for Valentine's Day, so that's why I picked them up. Random light bulbs, they were only 99 cent at Ikea. These were only 99 cent, and you can always like put these in a vase to uh, make them vase fillers. So this is just like random stuff that only cost a few dollars um, at Ikea's clearance department. But I'm really looking forward to using that um, that container and that container in my pantry when I go reorganize it. Forgot to share these. These were on um, clearance at Ikea. They're really long. And maybe they can get style for Valentine's Day as well. Um, I don't know. We'll see. I can always put them outside on my patio if I don't like them in my house. But yeah, they were only a few bucks. So I got two. Alrighty, here in my bedroom. This is some of the items that I purchased before we left for traveling on a road trip. I purchased these pillows. I don't know if I shared with these or not, but they came out of Burlington. They were in a pack and they were like $16.99. Super cute. Love them. Alright, let's talk about this. I have purchased these and I actually did a video and put them in my gift guide. But I didn't get to upload the gift guide um, because it was we ran out of time. And this is also in my gift guide. This super cute plush blanket it is absolutely beautiful came from home goods it was $39.99 and the pillow was only like $19.99 so look how cute that would have been an awesome gift for someone that loves like fluffy and things like that the only problem I have with these two items they're a bit more creamier than I like I think I like this like colors here and these have more like a yellow undertone because look at the blanket that I have here you can see like this is a little bit yellower um so I don't know if I'm going to return it or what but it's so beautiful and I love 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 this brand here yeah so maybe I'll store it away and maybe try to use it next year I'm not sure so I'm on a fence about it but I love it so much and I end up even getting um I took the pillow out because I was trying to play around with it. I was also have this p color as well. I've already taken the pillow out and put it upstairs. So I was about to store it away. So this is another color that I have like a creamy, no, like a gray color. Yeah, and it's also it's like this type of pillow. So that's how it looks there. Yeah. Either way, I like the material on them but I don't love um, the color but that's that okay I found this cutie at Burlington as well when I found those pillows and it was just I could not pass it up it was just so pretty to me I love the colors and the sparkle so here it goes and I just placed it here in this little in my bedroom like here's the bed and all of that and it's just in this little corner tucked away so so pretty and it was only probably like $9.99 really inexpensive but look at the color scheme I think that is beautiful yes so that is that is classic glam I love it breakfast at Tiffany's 100 years so these are different books so whatever yay and I have one more oh it looks so good against my curtains oh and I found this picture frame as well I haven't put anything in it but this picture frame came from Germany and then this one came from Burlington and it was only like four ninety nine, five ninety nine. I don't know really inexpensive and then I've already shared this with you this little necklace holder also came out of Burlington so I just have all this little merrily cute things here on my dresser.
so cute. Here goes the other one. I just placed it up here on the wall so you guys can see it really quickly. Um, thought it was really cute. Um, but I don't know. This one may actually go back. Um, or if I may hold on to it and maybe if I have a larger bar space whenever we move, maybe I can hold on to it for that purpose. But I just thought it was so darling. I like the champagne bottles and the books and all that. Or even if I get an office, that'll look really cute in the office space as well. Anyway, it's cute. It was inexpensive. So it's just standing here on the wall so I can share how it looks. Last but not least, I purchased, this was difficult to travel with as well, but we made it home. It's just a gold picture frame. It's really large and nice. We took a lot of family pictures, so I'm going to find one, get it printed out, and place it in here. Because we don't have any updated family pictures. So I just want to put it in this gold frame. And I like it. I don't remember how much it costs. But it's really cute and nice and simple. Oh, let me turn it. There you go. This may be. Oh, okay. It's a 16 by 20. And then if you turn it that way, it will be a 12 by 16. So. There you go. Hey Z Gallery. Again, we folded this bag to travel with, so that's why it's so crazy. Um, oh, I still have. Oh, I purchased these out of Home Goods as well. Um, I believe in Dallas, but these were $3.99. These are little cute cups that I can display in my coffee station whenever, you know, I go decorate for the little Valentine or whatever. But how cute. I thought they were really cute. And then these or just leave. So they were only a few bucks. I think I got a three. They are folded. I had the guy fold them so we can travel. Um, but this is how they look. So definitely for the fall, I'll pull them out. And then this, I can probably pull it out in the spring or something. I don't know. But I'll probably just leave it all wrapped up and then use it for the fall season. I think they were like three or four bucks for these. And then some of them are like velvet. So really cute purchase those i was trying to get the pumpkins but i couldn't um i didn't have any word to put them in the back of my car and the pumpkins were 70 percent off as well but i had to pass them up and he did not want to ship them because they were on clearance and tried to ask him like please ship them to my house um but he was just like we don't we don't ship clearance items blah 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 because if it breaks they can't replace it so that was that so this I got this stuff, the plates, um, those little rhinestone votive holders. Um, I think that's pretty much it from Z Gallery because we had no more room to travel with anything. And of course, we had the lamp in the back of the car. We had all those plates from Ikea in the back of the car. So that's that. All right, you guys, so I believe that is everything. I'm sorry if I miss some stuff. I'm ready to put this stuff away, so I was just trying to grab what I knew for sure that I had. Um, and maybe a few other, oh, I did buy something. Look, I see the bag right here. Um, Pier 1, they were, right as we were about to leave out, they were putting their Valentine stuff out as well. Some stuff out in like December, because we left like the 20, first of december and this stuff was already in stores so here goes okay so this came out and it was only like 20 something bucks i thought it was so cute i'm actually gonna look let's play let's see if it'll look right here whoa so this is where i had the little peace sign so let's see i need to hide that wire it fell down but yeah that's how it looks i thought it was so cute i told them let me have it so I didn't want to risk coming back from traveling and it already sold out because they only had a few. But again, and I had it, um, it was $22.50, but I had a coupon, 20 or 25% off, um, and that's that. So I got it less than 20 bucks. So cute, right? So I can't wait to um, set up all my little Valentine items. And uh, yeah, I may actually just leave that there. I don't know. We'll see. All right, you guys. So thank you so much for joining me on this home decor haul. I have a sprinkle of all type of stuff. 
even a few valentine items i'm probably going to start at the end of january start putting things out i had so much fun decorating last year for the valentine so once i get all this christmas stuff up and then live with simple decor for a little bit and i'll start pulling out valentine things and decorating because i i'm probably not going to buy anything for valentine i have enough from last year because i didn't go over overboard anywho thank you for joining me again happy new year once again and i will catch you guys on the next one bye for now Thank you.